Ciao internet, Axen here and I'm back again with another reaction video. Today we're gonna check out a new Technate reveal trailer for actually a brand new character. It's been a while since we've seen one of these. Uh, it's, it is called, he's called Victor Cheval Chevalier. Uh, I'm guessing he's a Frenchman. But I don't know shit apart from that about this character, so let's just go ahead and check it out, shall we? Let's see who this Victor guy is. Okay. Very curious. Very, very curious. Okay. We have... Sur la scène. Oh! oh. Look at, Look this, at guy. this guy! <laughs> okay, I like his face. Um, the outfit is kind of already seen. From France, okay. Oh, dig, dig, the, the music, music zone. Zone. Is he a hitman? Uh, what the, a sword? I didn't realize he had a sword. Holy. He has also some like uh, raven moves. That, a gun? How many weapons does this guy have? Too many weapons. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, against Raymond, which... Is he a Raven vi a rival or something like that? Okay. A lot of Raven-like moves. But with guns, knives, sword, teleports, and a gray suit. Whatever. Oh! He's a flashy mofo. If anything. Check him out. Scatter. Uh, there's some things that I like about him. There's some things that I really don't like. Uh, the music is good. Okay, 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 okay. Let's, 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 let's rewind it and watch it very, very slowly because I, there are a lot of things that I need to really gather and understand. Uh, yeah, 0.25 speed. Let's go ahead and check this French guy out. Um, silence, please. Okay, I, I need I need to focus on the details. So, holy hell! Um, the, uh, so the outfit design in in and of itself, so it's it's kind of safe. It's something that we already seen a lot in Tekken, like the suit, or kind of reminds me a bit of uh, Li Chao Lan suit, but without the coat, and um, like the the gray and purple. It's something that we already seen. Uh, since he, he, he looks to be, he seems to be a hitman, I would have liked him to be dressed a little more, like, a, a little less flashy, less visible, maybe, maybe a darker color or something like that. I, I feel that this kind of dress is super, super, well, I don't know if, if he's actually, like, a stealthy hitman, it could be just, like, a, like Rambo, it's a crazy hitman that just goes in. Crashes a party and kills everybody. I don't know. I don't know. But it's not that. So the biz, the business of this design is not about his dress or his like outfit, but about his, all his gadgets. Man, he has a like uh, this belt 
uh, with the sword, the, like the big flashy laser sword or whatever he has. And then he has a gun and then he has two, two knives or something like that. It's like, it's crazy flash. And then why, 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 why this? Why? Why does he have the sunglasses? At night. <laughs> Then he have already a lot of stuff going on. I like the fact that he is older. It's an older dude, which is something that is rare lately in Tekken. And I, like all these marks on his face, it gives gives him a little bit of personality, uh, which I like. I don't, I don't know. I don't know. I would have liked the design to be just a, like 10, 10 to twenty percent a little more understated than this, or something like that. Ah. Uh, Let's see. Let's see what happens. What? Wait, 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 wait. Voiced by Vincent Cassel? What? All right. Yeah. So they paid a lot to have this kind of voiceover. Why they they, they should have just gave him uh, like Vincent Cassel uh, face and stuff. I would have loved it more because Vincent Casale is like a very uh, slim guy. Uh, it's it's he it has a very slim figure, which have we could have been something different in Tekken, like a very different. And is it, is it, fast is like is it, is a fascinating guy, but it's not like a, a standard handsome man. I don't know how, how to say that. It's not like by. Um, Beauty standards, like he's not super handsome. He's just, he's just very cool guy, and uh, I would have loved to see like his appearance actually uh, dropping into Tekken like this. Since they've already done something like that with the actor from like The Walking Dead, like the the, the Negan actor, right? He had his actual like face. I know it's not very Tekken-y, having like a realistic face, but you know, I think they tried to inspire being a little bit inspired by Vincent Cassel, uh, I noticed that he had a, like a pretty pronounced nose for tech and character standards, right? Interesting. But it's interesting that they actually had uh, the chance to work with Vincent Cassel. <laughs> it's cool. I don't, I don't care about... Get ready for the next one. Uh, what's the name? Refined Violence. Oh, uh, yeah. I get it, like, uh, all, all Tekken designs are actually super busy, but I don't know. This is kind of generic, like, generic, super... Uh, to me, this costume looks like something that you put uh, put together in the customization menu for Tekken. Not something, like, ex um, strictly designed for, for a character costume, right? I don't know, but also the, the, the sunglasses uh, look a lot like something that you can put... Uh, on your character in the customizations option. Okay, okay, let's 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 watch a little bit of gameplay. Nice low kick into gunshots. Is this like uh, guaranteed on it or something like that, or maybe uh, a just frame stuff? That's a lot of plus frames. Okay, he has a disappearing move like. Uh, like Raven, he has a lot of stuff that very look very similar to it. Wait, 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 wait! Why, where the knives came from? Where did the knives came from? He just pulled down knife from his butt, from thin air, actually. Yeah, I okay. I like the effect from his like teleport and stuff. So there are actually different knives. One is just more like a regular knife, and the other is like a backwards uh, handling knife. Okay, yeah, he, he has cool movement. It seems pretty unique compared to the rest of the cast, uh, as far as the the way he moves. I like the sword stuff, uh, the poses that he actually gets into it when gets into when when he, when he uses a sword. Um, even though I, I, this is something that I, I have to point out every time I see, I watch a Tekken trailer like in slow mo, in very slow mo. It's and this is it's very evident how much 
uh, this game is mocapped versus like um, uh, uh, by hand animation because you can see all the glitches and stuff from the mocap when when you slow down the game. It's not as polished as something like Street Fighter. Okay, this is an armor move. Is this guaranteed? Yeah, it looks like. Uh, so I guess this character is gonna be fun to play, or at least for at the very least uh, fun to. Oh, is this a launcher? Yeah, this is while standing launcher, kind of like the um, the one uh, that uh, Leroy has. This combo looks very fun to to perform, kind of like uh, Yoshi's or Raven combos so this is punish and this is a, a move that can go into heat plus frames a lot of them all of them this is a frame trap holy man this is wow very so let me let me check that out again because that's the like x Extremely flashy, freaking uber flashy. Oh yeah, oh, yeah. we like we like, we like those. those. Oh, not nice. The, I guess so. This is the um, hit smash, of course. Very cool hit smash. I don't know. The whole design is not coherent enough for me. And here, here he here he comes. He's like assassination rival. Cool little sequence. Uh, hopefully, this is one of those that uh, actually happen when you when you start a fight against Raven. All right. Um. Yeah. Let's let's check the other moves out. Uh, also, his fighting stance kind of gener generic. Nothing uh, super cool about it. Okay, breaks the armor with a throw. Very, very similar throw animation to that of Raven. Actually, ap apart from this big, s whoa, 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 big smash on the ground. Okay, there was a counter. It is not a launcher though. So it's similar to Lars's uh, sweep there. But it, did it launch? Or, or was that a reset? I, I didn't get it. I'll, uh, let me check that again. Because this is very important for gameplay reasons. Because it's an invasive uh, low sweep. The guns, do they lead into a... Holy man, yes! Yes! It is an actual launcher. launcher. Jesus. All right. This guy seems pretty strong. Uh, well, that's all to be seen, but you know. Another disappearing movement right there. A move like that makes his hurt box disappear for a second. Those are tricky to play against. Nice kicks. There are some sometimes there are some poses that that really defy like uh, human body anatomy. <laughs> For example, this is this strange pose over here when he turns his body. Look at that! It was almost like like his spine broke in half <laughs> while doing that. The move. Uh, all right. Let's see. Is that a parry? Yeah, he has a, kind, some kind of a parry. Okay. Into heat addict. Eat another heat engager. Into pressure. And... Wait. Wait a minute. Is the sword a stance? Because this is the, the feeling that I'm getting. When he... Look at this. He's, he's gonna sheath his, war, his sword. Yes. And then it goes for the move. He's a stance character. character. I like stance characters. 
And I love that the kind of pop up, like the very looks very very powerful when when you like pop characters up like that for a combo. So he has a lot of very powerful looking moves, like uh, ground smashes and up uh, swings, uh, up swings with his sword, uh, really uh, make you feel the impact. So uh, from that side of things, I think he looks so awesome, right? The impacts are really, really nice. Let's see his rage art. I didn't focus on it the first time around, so let's see. Brings out his knives, all right. Big overhead smash into knife combo into flashy disappearance. Okay, make like a like laser mechanical sword checkmate said in a very uh weird way, French way of saying checkmate. Big rush. I see some uh, like Brian Fury vibes here with a big rush and and then like the going straight through the enemy. Okay, nice. Nothing, nothing to write home about, but uh, yeah, still cool. None. Uh, I I would say on 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 the better side of uh, rage drives, rage arts. I'm sorry. The sword in and of itself, I think it's cool. I don't think, uh, I don't think the outfit like just makes a lot of make a lot of sense with the rest of of his stuff. He is super mega like gadgeted uh, uh, soldier or something like that or, or assassin. And I would I would think that he would I don't know maybe they were trying to make him wear something fancy just because he's French or something like that. I don't know maybe their their idea of a French identity is like. Uh, Dressing with a, with a suit, I don't know, flashy suit or something like that. Um, okay, I'm liking the gameplay. Still, I think he is a lot. Is he is a lot? Very very busy character design. Uh, a lot of weapons, which is always kind of weird in Tekken, having a lot of weapons. I know they have incorporated some weapons with our characters in this game, like Law having nunchucks and stuff like that. But still very very busy uh having knives and swords and guns all together it just seems like something like fuck it let's just put every weapon on this guy it's kind of lazy of a design um i get i get the fact that maybe we already have like swordsmen and stuff like that we already already had somebody with a gun we already uh we don't have they could have just gone with knives something different and unique probably i don't know what do you guys think? I I I mean I will I will try the character because it looks fun to play at least. But uh, design wise, I don't think I like it. Uh, it's a big no no for me. Like I, I maybe maybe and this is an, uh, something that Tekken allows you to do. Maybe with a little bit of customization, I can make it look tolerable. Like give him some more tactical looking. Uh, um, suit or something uh, getting rid of those uh, shades because I don't think the shades like help him at all because I think his face is actually kind of cool and kind of different from the rest of the cast in some ways yeah 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 I'm, I'm torn uh, on him about like his visual representation still the gameplay looks very very fun so that's it, guys. Uh, thank you for watching the video again. Uh, please like, share, and subscribe if you like my content. And see you in the next video. Ciao, 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 ciao.